Hmm. All right, I understand. Welcome to all play, ladies and gentlemen. All right, so I said I'm going to play Don't Starve. I'm playing the vanilla version of Don't Starve, but it will load up this version as well, the, the same title screen. So let's see. Let me set the rules. Okay, so I'm playing uh, Don't Starve. I'm just playing vanilla mode. What I will do, though, I will play as a, what is it, a modded character, a character from the workshop. Uh, the Red Fox. Wakari the Red Fox. She has furs. Oh, no, that's not her who has it. Uh, furs and horns? I don't adore them. Uh, she's the sly cousin of the hounds, so the hounds won't attack her unless she bothers them. Uh, she's good at escaping. She's actually a faster character. But she has a downside. She doesn't eat vegetables. So I'm going to take this to the next level. Okay, this is an alt play. It wouldn't be an alt play if I didn't do things differently. So for this play, what I'm going to do is I'm going to be a farmer. This is pro farming simulator here. And I'm not going to change the world. We're just going to play... Uh, a standard version of Don't Starve. All right, without further ado, let's not starve. Say, pal, you don't look so good. You better find something to eat before night comes. All right, so like I said, this is Pro Farming Simulator. <laughs> this is the same player, Don't Starve, you know, survive. But I'm playing with a few mods. Let's see if I can name all of them. Okay. So this character is a mod. She's a fox girl, but she follows the same name theming uh, in the arts game. Uh, in case you didn't know, all the characters are named uh, words that begin with W. Uh, I have the always on map. Let's see. Is that what they call it? The, the uh, mini map. I'm sorry. That's the mini map that's right beside the uh, day clock. If you look at the health. Let's see what it is. If you look at my health, stomach, and sanity, there are numbers below them. Those numbers are always there. So that I don't have to pause the game. Or I'm sorry, not pause the game, but if I don't have to stop play in order to check my sanity and all that. Uh, I have a space for my backpack. Uh, typically, let's see. If you look at the bottom of the screen, typically the backpack will go here. Uh, it counts. It, it's not really a shirt, but it goes in that area. So you can't wear a shirt or armor. In your backpack at the same time. But I have a mod that puts it on this side. Uh, I have the 99 stack mod. I, I, it's just a lot of mods on this. <laughs> I have a 99 stack mod. Typically, items max out at 20 or 40 in your inventory. In which case, once you pick up the next one, it'll have another space. So, for example, if I... Let's see. If I have picked up all the grass I could, this would go to, I think... 30, it's either 30 or 40 for the grass. And then once I pick up number 31 or number 41, it'd go here. Typically, now the stacks will go all the way to 99. I have, actually I haven't used this mod. I either haven't used it or haven't seen it. So I don't know if that one even works. Any more mods? Uh, there's two more mods. We won't see them for a while, most likely. But I'll go ahead and tell them. Uh, I don't think it shows up on the mini map, but on the pause screen map. Oops this map uh whenever i jump in a wormhole typically i'm going to come out another wormhole on another side of the world oh right there i can demonstrate it now okay so yeah it doesn't show up on the mini map so this is a wormhole you can see it on the map when i jump in i'll come out on another side of the world no problem there because it's only two wormholes i can easily tell you know which wormhole this was but let's see I get to four wormholes. Let's see I get to six, eight. It becomes a little confusing to try and figure out which one. Oh, it actually does show up on the map. I see it already. Uh, you can see that the wormhole is shaded a little blue. And it's blue here. And it's blue here. That helps me keep track of which wormhole leads where. I don't, like I said, I don't really need it now because I only have two wormholes. It's not too hard. I can remember. Listen, I can do math and figure it out where it ends up. And then for four wormholes, I can figure that out. But once it gets to... Once it gets to six, then I start to get confused without that. Again, this is pro farming simulator. I need to simplify simplify what I need to remember as much as possible. And then the other wormhole. I'm sorry, the other mod. This is the last mod that I believe I have in. Um, this mod makes it so that beefalo show up on the mini map. Oh, my God. Where my map go? There we go. Okay. Beefalo show up on the map. I'm not again. I'm not sure if it'll show up on the mini map or not, but I know it will show up on the select screen map. 
Beefalo are a very important part, very important part of Pro Farming Simulator. I'm going to go back through that wormhole just because I need what was over there much more than I need what's here. Uh, and Wakari, well, I'll get into that when I come out the wormhole. Oh, another mod. I have the PlayStation button mod on or the Xbox mod on. That was on last time, too. Wakari well, has a Fox Tribe Bell staff. Honestly, I have no idea what it does. I haven't used it. And she starts with five monster meat because she can't. She doesn't eat vegetables. She'll eat meals made with vegetables as long as there's meat in it. But she won't eat just straight up vegetables. Um, so typically you have a hard start until you can figure out how to kill some animals. That's where those five monster meats come in. She can eat monster meat with no problem. And that's just what we're going to do. That's just what we're going to do, ladies and gentlemen. Again, this is pro farming simulator today. My goal is to make a farm that can keep itself alive, that is self-sustaining as quickly as possible. I think the fastest I've ever done this is three days. I got really lucky. Three days without changing what the world looks like. I got ridiculously lucky. Everything was where I needed it to be. Right now, I'm kind of just worried about surviving until the end of the day. Because it's looking, it's looking a little rough, to be very honest with you. Let's see. I, I think... Oh, no. I don't have enough rocks yet. I want to make... This This area is a good starting area. This is, Everything's where I need... Everything... Every resource that I need is here. It's just not so abundant. But I will make a base if I can find three more rocks. I know offhand I need... Uh, 12 rocks to make a fire pit so let's see if I can make this if I can find three more rocks before the end of the day I'll make a base here you can see the speed difference this is typically how fast Wilson runs when he's on a path she's not even on a path so that means she's going to be ridiculously fast when we take off let's see I don't think uh, I don't think I'm going the right direction for rocks Wasting time, wasting time. Let's get these here. I don't think she'll eat cranberries either. No, she won't eat cranberries. So I kind of have to get things as quickly as possible. Because if this runs out, then I'm really in trouble. If I run out of monster meat, then I'm really in trouble. So I kind of want to make meals before anything. That's enough rocks. Right? No. I don't have enough wood. Uh-oh. 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 Run out of time. You're better than this, chill. This is what you do. Okay, okay. Wood, wood. This is a good tree. Here we go. Come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Oh, 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 oh. I need the rocks. I need the rocks. Where my rocks go? Oh, my God. Why does this always happen? Why does this always happen? Did it. <laughs> Did it. <laughs> All right. Now it's time to get serious. Oh, I put it near the ocean. That's dumb. All right. That's fine. It's, it's okay. We can grow from here. Got to work tonight. Okay. Um. I need to spend my nights gathering resources. That's the thing. Step back. Step back. There we go. We remember, we remember what happened last time. We remember what happened last time. <laughs> it was not fun. Uh, what I want, I wanted to put down the pine cones. That way, I have trees, and I feel good. And I feel like I'm doing my part. Okay, so the first thing that I need to do for a farming simulator is I need to get the science machine. That's definitely the first step. So we got, we got a few things we got to get. Gold nuggets, uh, logs, and rocks. Got to get to it. That's the plan for, for day two. After, after science machine, I think I need to locate the buffalo. Beefalo. It would probably be smart if I did that. Because everything else that I need to do can be done once I find the beefalo. 
All right. Let's, let's have a strong day, too. Let me check the map real quick. Let's see. I don't know if this path here connects down to where the other wormhole came out. If it would be, it honestly, it would be great if it did. That means I wouldn't have to keep taking that wormhole. Honestly, I don't like jumping in the wormholes. I try and I try and make sure Sandy is the one stat I don't have to worry about. Jumping in the wormhole makes it so I have to worry about the wormholes or Sandy. I don't need that X. Eh, I'll take it. I'll take it. All right, looks like it does connect here. Hopefully. Okay, it does. Good. No, it doesn't. Oh, no, it doesn't. Does it go up this way and connect? Oh, no. It doesn't connect. Okay. So I'm going to have to jump in that. Oh, it, it does. I seize it. I seize it. Yeah, it does. Okay. No. Oh. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay. Oh, so this area has its downfall. If I want to explore somewhere else, I'm going to have to take that wormhole. See. Oh, you gotta go around the tree. Okay, so we're reaching this here area. I don't know the different names for the biomes, but guess what? Ah! <laughs> okay, we got me. Okay, so we got a gold nugget. We just need rocks. Oops, wrong button. Normally that has me zoom out when I press the right trigger. It'll have me zoom out. I changed the controls, though. I changed it to be better, and I'm still making mistakes. Good job, chill. All right, here we go. We're good now. Oh, never mind. We, we need help. There we go. All right, we're going to take these gold nuggets back to our base. I feel like I should make a new base. The only thing I, the only thing wrong with that base where I put it is that it is near an edge, so it's kind of not giving me land to stand on. It's not widening my blind spot or my visible spot. Right, I'm probably gonna make a base over here if this is where gold nuggets are. And she's hungry. When he gets to fifty, it, it reminds me, hey. The game's called Don't Starve. It'll be all right. There's a reason I haven't built it yet. I haven't built the uh, the science machine yet. There we go. This is a, an area that I'm looking for. Okay. So here's what I need to do next. After I locate the... Oops. After I locate the beefalo. I need to have charcoal. Wrong button. There we go. I need to have charcoal in order to create oh light it please there we go thank you i need to have charcoal in order to build a what's it called what do they call it it's a crock pot in order to build a crock pot again i need to make meals eating 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 those uh the meat it's gonna help me survive for a day i need to last longer than one day <laughs> It lasts longer than a day, and I do that by making meals with the meat. I only put in one meat, and I put in all those cranberries that I can't eat by themselves. And I put in the, the carrots I can't eat by themselves. There's a formula to this. There's a formula. Let's see here. Okay, I'll probably... This area? Yeah, because... Oh, no, no. This is an edge, too. This is towards the... Uh, boundaries of the world as well honestly I might as well go back let's see I should oh no I don't have I, there's no way I have enough for uh for uh, the machine I need more wood I need more wood all right can't take those with me let's plan them let's plan them Wherever I rest tonight is going to have to be where I make my real base. Because that hunger is getting down. Oh, oh, I think this is a good spot for a base. This is a good spot. Okay. Okay. Everything's, everything's coming together. Everything's coming together. Here we go. Science machine is done. Let's establish this as a base. Put this here. All right. So we got the science machine done. Next is food. Again, farm is, farm is the goal. So we need to get to alchemy. Alchemy machine next 
crock pot. Okay, we need to make uh, what is those? Those are stone, I believe they call it. Cut stone, yes. All right, so we need what three of them? I think I said. I'll drop these. I don't need those right now. Uh, and one more. Forget it. Forget it. I know the. Oh no! Wait. Oh, it's in my pocket already. Okay. Next, uh, crock pot. Let's see, I'm gonna put the crock pot here. I really hope I don't set it on fire. I'm good for it. Okay, let's cook. Cook, cook, cook. Uh, and we'll throw in cranberries. Cook. Go to work. Wait. Oh, it's just cooking. Okay. All right, so that's cooking. We have our new base. We're, we're doing it. We're, we're surviving. We are not. Listen. I want you guys to go back and watch. <laughs> I want you to go back and watch the playthrough with Shipwreck. Watch both of those. And watch how quickly I died. This is how quickly I'm surviving now. Look at how different. Look at how different. Perfect. Let's cook some more. Cook, 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 cook. Close. Oh, no. Cook. Here we go. Oh, my God. This 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 is a pick me up. <laughs> this is a pick me up because don't sh don't start shipwrecked. Had me feeling like I didn't know what I was doing. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> okay, uh, I'll eat this too. I'll eat this tonight, and we'll make wait eat. There we go. We'll make one more. This should be ready in the morning. Doesn't take that long to cook. It's a crock pot. Okay, so we got many things done. We got many things done now. Next step, we have to move forward. I think I have enough. Yeah, I have enough gold nuggets for the alchemy machine. But we need to get to the farms, too. Again, this is pro farming simulator. We got to get to the farms. That's a huge part. Uh, let's see. I'll throw this in the fire. No. No, I won't. Yeah, I will. Okay. I was going to say for, for another thing that I make, but I forgot. It doesn't really matter too much here. It doesn't really matter, so I'm not gonna do it. Oops, I shouldn't have eaten that just yet. Oh well. Okay, so we gotta we gotta start hunting now. That's the thing. We gotta start hunting too. The list, the to do list for this is insane. It is insane. Okay, we got many things on the player for tomorrow. So we'll do it tomorrow.